All right, you guys, we got a problem. So for the last three nights in a row, we've woken up and our trash has been like this. Tipped over and today we got a little cup of ranch dressing that's licked clean. Something is getting in to our garbage. It's seriously a bear. What do you think it's gonna be? It's a real bear. A bear. Maybe we can explore and find out. You think we can find out? But I'm scared. What do you think it is, Cars? I think it's a bear. A bear? If we have a bear getting into our garbage, obviously that's a little bit scary when we send our kids outside or, you know, if there's just a bear walking around the house. It freaks me out a little bit. Uh, so today, we're gonna find out what's getting into our garbage can. Raise that hand if you wanna be my buddy! To find out who's getting into our trash. Carson, come on, let's go. You better get on your scooter. Well, I just want to walk. Look, I got a better idea. What? Did you guys forget that your dad started a camera company? Yeah. What do you think the best way is to see if it's really a bear getting into our trash? Wise cam. Let's use a wise cam. We'll stick it on the outside of the house, even though they're not supposed to be on the outside. We'll wire it up and we'll film overnight. And if it gets into the garbage can, we'll get a little motion detection. So we'll know that something's moving. And then we'll find out what's getting into our trash. I'd rather go, go and find out in person. How are you gonna find out in person though? I'll just ride my bike until I find it. You mean a bear finding a bear? I'm so scared to find out. You don't wanna know what it is? I'm so scared. What? What if we? What if that bear eats us? How about this? How about we try your plan first? If that doesn't work, then we'll try my plan. Sure. Is that okay? Yes. But we're gonna need to pack some lunches. Okay. Let's pack a lunch. Sure. Let's go. How about some apples? We need some healthy things, and then maybe a sweet. Let's go. Let's go. You want to take your bikes? I am yep. so hungry. This should be time to eat. Of course, this isn't the time to eat, silly. You already want to eat your snack? All right, let's go. This is, seems like a good place to eat our lunch, right? It's nice and flat. Yeah. Let's have a little seat and eat. I'm getting weak. All right, there's your sandwiches in here. What if you turn into a wild Claire? Rawr! Now you're a wild Claire. I think I just heard a bear. That was you! That was you! That wasn't. That's this. I didn't. That's a good. I didn't. Claire, you did. I didn't. The first time the bear got into our garbage, it slashed a milk carton, and we have its claw marks on our milk carton. So if we can find a track for a bear, we can compare it to our milk carton to know if it's the same bear, and then we can know if it's really a bear that got into our garbage. So let me know if you see any bear tracks, okay? Carson, let me know if you see any bear tracks, okay? Okay, I'm so afraid. Wait a second, is that the bear down by that log? Is that the bear down there? Mm. Just a squirrel. I'm scared. Should we go back? Yeah. 
So now what's our plan B? Let's go use a wise cam. We're gonna use a wise cam and set it up and see if we can catch him on camera and see if it really is a bear. All right, let's get out of here. Time for plan B, wise cam. 1080p camera, it's a company I started about a year and a half ago. If we hook it up, it'll send a notification if there's motion. So if that bear is getting into our garbage, I'll get, a, I'll get a little notification on my phone that says there's motion detected and then we'll be able to see a little 12 second clip of the bear getting in. But if we want to record it longer than 12 seconds, there's this little hole in the bottom right there. You push it. We put a micro SD card in and then it records 24 seven. So then if we do catch the bear, it'll just record the whole process of him getting into the trash. And then we can get this footage from our phone and be able to see the whole thing. Let's see the whole thing. We want to see the whole thing, right? Yeah, let's put it by our garbage. The other thing is Wisecam is not technically made for outside, but people do it all the time. As long as it doesn't really get super wet, um, it's usually fine, but like we have one in our back on our the back of our house that's been there for a long time, and it's a twenty dollar camera. So even if it does break, I'm not like super worried about it. Yeah, you okay. get a bunch of them because they're free. Yeah. Right? The other cool thing is this little adhesive. So you you stick the adhesive, put a little metal plate on it. Wise cam is magnetic, so it'll stick to the plate, and then that'll stick around the house. And then if any bear comes by, we'll see the whole thing happen. <laughs> You're gonna skip rope with the wise cam cord? Maybe. Possible. <laughs> Let's see it. <laughs> Whoa! You are seriously good at that. I'm trying to do the cross now. Alright, I need that cord. Hook up our wise cam. Nope! It's taken. <laughs> Alright, where should we put it? Maybe we should open up the window and we'll hook the wise cams are right there. That's Did you give good. her the supplies? Um, we hook the wise cams right up underneath the window. Underneath the window? What's that sticky thing? Okay. Now, hold this. Todd, how was your out the window experience? Good. I would say not good. Stick right there, aim it right at that garbage can. And there's our camera. Think it's good enough for the bear? Yep. So now it's just a waiting game. We're gonna wait until I get a notification on my phone and see if we can catch the bear. The next day. The first night, the only thing we caught on the camera was a couple of crows. And when I was looking at that crow footage, uh, it was just so far away. Tonight I'm gonna to actually move it down closer to the garbage because if we do catch something, if we do catch something, I don't wanna get the shot so far away. And because our neighbors have like a really good light on their house right over here, uh, it's actually illuminates it pretty good. So I'm gonna turn the night vision on the camera off and hopefully it's good enough. So I'm gonna put it right here. One eternity later. Guess what happened? What? Guess what we caught on the wise cam? The garbage cans are knocked down. Did the bear? Should we check it? <laughs> okay. This is at 4.25 a.m. You just barely see him. There he is. <gasps> the bear cave.
think that bear was ridiculously crazy. He's trying to eat our garbage. Let's see if he comes back tonight. Let's see if he comes back tonight. What are we going to do? I don't know. Do you think he knows we're watching him? No. Do you want to wake up early so we can try to spot him with our own eyes? At 4.30 in the morning, here he comes. <laughs> wake us up at 4.30 in the morning. No, I don't want to get eaten. He's like, well, that one didn't open. You tell the other one. <laughs> All right, I'm just walking into work here. I gotta show everyone to work this video. It's not every day you catch a bear on your wise cam. Check this out. <laughs> this is my garbage. Oh, you got it? I got it. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. So, this is a bear <laughs> in my house, dude. What? <laughs> <laughs> Oh my, where do you <laughs> live? Are you in like the forest? <laughs> yeah. Technically you are living in a wild animal zoo. <laughs> yeah. I think it's coming back tonight. He's gonna come back tonight? I think he is not. What are we gonna do to get rid of the bear? There's nothing we can really do about it. You're right, I can go wrestle him. You yeah, teach him a lesson. That's seriously such a bad idea. Do you think I could take him? No. Do you don't think I could take a bear? You need to go to a wrestling training course. You think that once I go to the wrestling the wrestling training course, then I'll be able to take him? You need to learn how to fight. You don't know how to fight bears. How do you know? You've never seen me fight a bear. He'll eat you and Dad, I don't want you hurting animals, okay? Just leave him be. Let him get in the garbage if he wants. <laughs> I don't think I want a bear walking around our house. I got little kids running around. We got to get rid of them. The most common thing in Seattle is bears and rain <laughs> and no sunshine. I don't think bears are that common. I think that's kind of a crazy thing that happened to us. Uh, it's not like we live in the boonies. We we just live in, you know. Okay. Um, Hope you guys all have an excellent week. That's it from the Crosby this week. And no bears. Hope you have no bears at your houses this week. And we'll keep you all updated on the bear situation. Right? Well, I guess there's nothing we can do about it. So I guess see we you just... guys. See you guys. guys. All right, we'll see everybody. We'll see you all in the next adventure. adventure. See you all in the next adventure. Me. See ya.